the zone from the left side. Cuts to the face. Scores! And they put the power in power play. So elusive when he gets the puck on his stick and see he can't get a handle on him. They try to knock him over a couple of times, but he weaves his way through and puts it in the net. Montreal's given themselves something that everybody in sports longs for. Hope here, Ray. Hope, a chance. Hey, it's here. Something. Time isn't the enemy yet. Quick pass to Tavares. Explores his options behind the net. Moves it quickly over to Marner. Here's the shot. Levels him with the hit. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. The home team have gained possession off the wall. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Dowdy's got it deep in the offensive end. Denies up with the blocker. What a stop by Seros. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. Here he is, shot right in front. And he makes the save on that play. And that goes off a player. Taken along the wall by Zegras. Pushes it across to Matthews. To the low slot. And that doesn't reach the net. Looking to set up offensively. Shot. Whoa. He scores! I believe a call in Mars likes to call those back to back. Yeah, the coaches want you to stay aggressive after you score. They do that, and they're able to put another one up on the board. Man, that's like a practice drill. They executed that odd man rush perfectly. They expose the defender and then deliver the puck into the net. Just here in the late stages of this frame, Montreal's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. Slides the puck across to Ovechkin. The home team have taken possession along the wall. To the front! And he makes the save. Ottinger's on top of that one for a whistle. Little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. Moments away from the faceoff. Let's get back to the action. Forsberg's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Blocked in traffic. the period to an end. All right, third period just around the corner. We'll get a clean sheet of ice. I'm going to get more popcorn, and we're coming back with much more next. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, who is at ringside. Ray, we've got two periods played. How do you see this thing? Montreal's been chasing this game and chasing the puck much of the first two periods. If they're going to get back in it, they've got to possess the puck a lot more. Pretty simplistic look here. They like this, though. It's the two big shooters at the top. Unload the shot and then get traffic around the goal for either a tip or a rebound. They've done this well. Latang's got a hold of the puck behind the net. And the save. The home team have the puck against the boards. Takes the feed. Tries to the crease. And they score shorthanded. You go into this penalty trying to keep the game level. Now you get a bonus, that shorthanded goal. 
The home team have scored a big goal here in this third period. It's funny, James. If you come into the third period with a two-goal lead, everybody says it's the worst lead in hockey. Now you score in the first five minutes. It's a great lead. I'm so confused. Always. Hits it on, man. Rush. Two on one. Oh, what a save by Saros. And another stop. Oh, he's on it there. Both saves are really good ones. Sackick's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Sackick. Tavares is prepping to get back into the play as the penalty's almost over. Montreal's power play is over. What a disaster as they give up a shorthanded goal. I certainly didn't like much about that power play. The shorthanded goal, of course, is the exclamation point. And he keeps that one out. Saros is going to hang on for a face-off here. Getting himself a little bit of a breather. He's been a busy man in no there kidding. today, and it's been outstanding. Still lots of time left in the period. Up to eight goals scored so far tonight. It's 5-3. And now it's grabbed by Byram. Solani's got it into offensive territory. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. And that's knocked away by Yossi. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. And he regains control of the puck. Battle along the boards. Taken by Jenner. Close save, and the play continues. They were talking on the bench. Don't give in. Don't give in. Now they get one. Now they've got to find one more. Good thing he one times his puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. Montreal's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. Tavares wins it in the dots. Can't make it work. Here's a short pass to Miller. Saros feels the need to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Well, this game is, is starting to run itself down towards the end. A, a mistake now would be a dangerous one. Fox is a big part of this team's offense, guys. They're trailing at the moment, and you know he'll be looking to use his zone ability to get things going. It's a contact sport, people. There's proof right there. Great hit on the play. Can't connect on the pass. Grabbed along the board by Matthews. Montreal's got control of it now from their own end. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. And now he moves it quickly to Rantanen. Unable to reach that one. Broken up at center by Brody. The Canadians have done a really good job of chopping the ice in half. Good stick position. Really good play without the puck. Now they've got to generate something when they get that turnover. Here they come, down the right side and on the attack. Oh, that goes off the mask, and it stays out. Well, whatever you got to do, I guess. Man, those guys are lucky the masks are as good as they are now. Pasternak's carrying it ahead. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Pasternak's got the green light to try this move almost anywhere on the ice. The coaches have great faith in his ability, but he just can't complete it. Here's a chance. Canadians get a hold of the puck in their own end. Gains the zone through the middle. Montreal's got the puck against the boards. Moves it to McDavid. Less than 60 seconds left here in the final frame. Saros off to hang on to it to get a whistle. You start to wear down a little bit. You need your goalie to help you out. Getting it. To the later stages of this period. One goal game here. 5-4 is where we sit. 
And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Takes the feed from the left side. Montreal's got possession of the puck. Stevenson's got it against the boards. Terrific comeback for them. They've been playing from behind the entire game. They finally tie it up. Montreal's answered back here late in the third. Huge third period goal to tie things up. They've really worked hard and deserved this spot in the game. Now we'll see at even. Do coaches really shorten their bench out and start double shifting, guys? Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Puck scooped up by Brody. Quick feed to Stevenson. Here's a chance. Denies him on the play. The Canadians take it from the side. Here he is on the backhand. And he turned that aside as we continue play here. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. I'm not so sure there's a good time to take a penalty, but I know this isn't. Lots of pressure on the killers now. Boy, what a chance for the man advantage unit as they take to the ice for the first power play on their side all game. Huge blocker saved by Ottinger. There's the horn. Neither team giving an inch to each other tonight, and so we'll go to overtime next. Sabalski, time to boogie. Here we go. Overtime is officially underway. Sends a pass in front, and that doesn't go as it's off a stick. Here they come, three of them. Easily turned aside by Ottinger, and that's just out of reach. Byron's got it near the point. Tiptoes across the blue line. That's gloved by Ottinger. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. McDavid's at the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Moves the puck behind the net. Drives it to the crease. Oh, a missed opportunity here in overtime as the power play expires. Well, the escape there, that's a bad spot to put your team shorthanded in overtime. But the PK does the job. Takes a shot. Good stop by Saros. Puck picked up by Stevenson. Saros elects to hang on and get a whistle here, Ray. Yeah, pretty soon, James, the players in front of him are running all over the place. They're trying to help, but they're not. That cover was important. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. McDavid's won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Quick pass to Fox. Shot! A chance for the win! Thank you. 